Ah, Christmas. The most festive time. Oh, hang on, wait. I said this was gonna be subtle, didn't I? Okay, give me a minute. Hello, my name is Caitlin and welcome back to another holiday video. I want in this video to walk us through outfits for the holiday season that are subtly festive. I am a person who tends to go extremely overboard <laughs> for every holiday, so I will wear a really outlandish Christmas sweater basically at every opportunity. I wore this in an office once. Today's video is more focused on more realistic ways to make your outfits in December feel a little bit more festive without going overboard. Because I know many of you do want to celebrate the holiday season, but maybe you just don't want to go all out, which is completely fine. So the first tip, and one that will weave its way through this video, I'm sure, is to make use of festive colors as a centerpiece for your outfit, but not necessarily the total package. I have a very, very bright red. What's this called? This is called, I was gonna say tank top, turtleneck. Whew. Caitlin, where is your brain? Uh, mostly thinking about cookies and BTS these days, to be honest. I have this turtleneck that I wear all throughout the winter, but I really like it during the holiday season because it is just a little bit more festive. So I tend to make this the focal point of an outfit, pair it with a red lip, and then try to build an outfit around that. And because it's really cold, I like to add a big, fuzzy, cozy sweater over top for layering purposes. But I've also paired it with a pair of high-waisted jeans with a black belt. Black and gray are pretty much the accent colors for this one. And I have a pair of festive socks on, which I'll talk about in a minute. I think this is just a nice way to give a nod to the season and then get progressively more into it. All right, next tip is to use holiday or Christmas adjacent colors. And this is an exact outfit I wore to work leading up to Christmas this time last year when, you know, we were in offices. This sweater is sort of a cranberry tone, which reminds me of those cranberries in a can. You know, the cranberry sauce that no one ever ate. Well, my dad ate it. He still likes the cranberries in a can. I don't know, I feel like we only ever get that for him. And we don't often have it for Christmas, we have it for Thanksgiving, so I don't know why I'm really bringing it up. I've utilized my sweater tucking techniques from my sweater, how to style chunky winter sweater video. And this is very, very subtle, and it is a way to bring that holiday spirit in without necessarily, again, going overboard. So if you have any colors in your closet that you tend to wear during the winter, but more specifically are sort of warm in tone, have the, are on the red spectrum, then break them out this time of year. And again, pair them with something fairly neutral, like these flared, flared, ugh, flared pinstripe dress pants. Next tip is to make good use of your accessories. So if you look at this outfit on its own, it's got some nice warm and jewel tones with the emerald green in the sweater and the sort of warm camel color of the pants, but it's not necessarily Christmassy. I would wear this outfit in January, February, March when it's freezing cold, but to make it extra Christmassy, this is where the accessories come in. When you pair this shirt with a red lip, suddenly the Christmas factor is amplified. I've also got my novelty Christmas socks on as well. These are actually cropped pants so you can see the socks when you wear a pair of boots with it. And I've got my good old high school grad ring which happens to be a ruby which is my birthstone. And when you add something like 
this gorgeous little wreath brooch that my mother-in-law got for me. Suddenly, your outfit is a lot more Christmassy, but it's also still fairly understated. It doesn't have to be a full-blown deck the halls on view. <laughs> but through accessories, you've elevated the outfit into more of a holiday themed outfit. You'll also notice that there aren't a lot of sequins or sparkles or jewels. And that's because I think this year is very different in the realm of hall dressing for the holidays. You're hopefully not going to be going to parties or outings. So these outfits are really more cozy, home wear, things you can wear on Zoom calls and FaceTime and things with your family who you would normally be getting together with. All right, quick disclaimer with this outfit is that I know this is a very Christmassy skirt, but I had it anyway. And I do wear it more than, more times a year than just Christmas. But the tip here is to look through your closet for all of the sort of cream or white cozy knits that you have and think about whether or not you can tuck that into a nice skirt with some colors. If you have a black skirt, if you have a green velvet skirt, if you have a pleather skirt, anything could work because the same rules apply. So if you have this sort of gorgeous warm cream knit, just pair that with a skirt of any kind with maybe a nice cute pair of socks. And again, use the accessories rule of <laughs> red and green and you're good to go. I actually have this green velvet scrunchie as well, which from an accessory standpoint, I think would look pretty cute with this outfit. Now I'm doing this ponytail on camera, so it's probably gonna be an absolute disaster. Do I look like a peacock? So think about the way that the outfits that you already own or the pieces for winter that you already have could be made Christmassy. That way you don't have to spend a lot of money on holiday accessories. You don't have to spend a ton of time on searching through thrift stores for an ugly Christmas sweater. You don't have to make your own stuff. You can find a very subtle way to make the clothes that you own already work for the holidays. Because let's face it, if you buy a sweater you don't really wanna own that you think is kind of tacky, you're either gonna go one of two ways. You're never gonna wear it, so it's gonna waste space in your home, or you're gonna throw it out, which is kind of wasteful. Think hard about what you're gonna purchase this holiday season. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you liked this video and sh maybe share it with someone who is not sure what they're gonna wear this holiday season. And if you have any other suggestions for me, any other holiday themed videos you wanna see, let me know on Instagram because I need to know, okay? Happy holidays, everyone. I will be back next week with, um, I don't know yet, another, uh, another video.